This is um, Big Dog's porting right here. Um, just a demonstration on what kind of port work that we do here. Uh, right here we have uh, uh, Ford 302 5.0 liter EFI uh, GT40 lower manifold. And just want to demonstrate, you know, we got a lot of guys out there saying that, you know, our port work is similar to every other porter's port work out there. And that's just not true. Um, our port work is a lot more aggressive. Um, it's geared towards maximum horsepower with these parts. Um, a lot of things that guys wish that they can get out of these manifolds, we're actually getting, and then some. So, just a little demonstration. Here's a seventh, eighth long socket. I uh, kind of see that seventh, eighth, and um, this socket can't fit through the Edelbrock RPM two RPM. Um, a lot of the aftermarket manifolds for this application, they can't fit through. But with our port work, you know, you have a situation where plenty of wiggle room. It falls through that one very easily. We know all of these is pretty, pretty easy. Let's go to some of the hard ones, which is the number five and the number one. Falls through there very easily. Here's the number one falls through there. So the level of port work on these manifolds that we do is pretty amazing. Um, we increase the cross section area and the port flow of each runner. And this averages about 280 plus CFM. So as you can see, that's a lot of CFM for this manifold. The upper, we also modify the upper to match the lower. Together, it's about 280 CFM. So you're not going to get that from too many aftermarket out-the-box manifolds for this application. So check us out on Facebook at Big Dogs Port. All right.